This video is going to show you how to set up voicemails in smartphone. Now, uh, there are two types of voicemail uh, inboxes. There is a individual user's voicemail inbox, and then there are, of course, group inboxes where multiple users uh, have access to them. Uh, let's start with the individual voicemails. Each user is going to need to set up their own voicemail uh, answering machine message and they can do that by simply going up to their user up in the top right and going to the my account and you see here the second tab is voicemail and you have the same options you do with all audio uh, in smartphone you can either read the text like a robot you can record using a phone and if you choose this option you'll enter your phone number and uh, the smartphone will call you and you can leave a message uh, choose from the existing library the media manager library which again you can access up right here or you can upload an mp3 file directly yourself so those are you, th this is the individual uh, users. So in my case, Jordan Fleming's um, actual uh, voicemail, personal voicemail inbox, and this is the recording that would be played. Now, um, in order to look at some of the group ones, let's just go over to call flows uh, because you establish what to do with um, your voicemail by actually deciding to do it on each individual call flow. So uh, let's just quickly um, start over and we'll do a very quick flow, uh, standard flow that we see all the time where we're dialing a user, Jordan Fleming, and at the end we are going to want, if nobody answers, we're going to do a voicemail. Now we have, just like with the dial where you can choose a user or group, you can do the same for voicemail. Now, if you choose user, you would select the user and that person's recording would be played and it will go into that person's inbox to be listened to, as well as, of course, in Podio. Um, now, if you choose a group, then you can choose specifically which type of uh, voicemail message the caller is going to hear. Just like before, um, you can read the text, record the phone, choose from the library or upload an MP3 and select which of your groups that you are actually going to uh, send this voicemail to and who's going to have access to it inside of smartphone. So both of those, um, the, the real key takeaway for me is you do have to realize that every user has their own inbox uh, for voicemails. And if the flow determines that it goes to their user, you're going to need to make sure they have their own personal uh, voicemail recording done. Um, and then, of course, if you're using the group ones, you can manage everything directly from here and you can choose from your existing library or upload a new one.